Welcome to the History of Simple Things, where we delve into the fascinating history behind the little things that shape our world. Ever wonder why most traffic signs are colored white and green? It's a question that may not have crossed your mind until now, but the answer lies in a fascinating blend of history, psychology, and practical design. In this video, we will delve deep into the reasons behind this ubiquitous color choice, exploring the factors that make white and green the preferred colors for traffic signs around the world. Let's dive into the history first. The standardization of traffic signs began in the early 20th century as automobiles became more common and road networks expanded. Before this period, road signs varied greatly from one region to another, creating confusion for drivers. The need for a standardized system became evident, and organizations like the American Association of State Highway Officials and later the Federal Highway Administration in the United States took the lead in developing a cohesive set of guidelines. In the early days, traffic signs were often handmade and lacked uniformity. Colors, shapes, and symbols were inconsistent, making it challenging for drivers to understand their meanings quickly. This inconsistency led to accidents and general confusion on the roads. To address this issue, the first Manual on Uniform Traffic Control Devices MUTCD, was published in 1935. This manual established the standard colors, shapes, and symbols for traffic signs in the United States, setting the stage for what we see today. The choice of colors in traffic signage is not arbitrary. Each color is chosen for its visibility, psychological impact, and ability to convey specific messages quickly. Green and white were selected for informational and directional signs for several key reasons. Green is a color that is easy on the eyes. It is one of the most visible colors in the spectrum, second only to yellow, which is why it is often used for cautionary signs. Green also has a calming effect and is associated with safety, making it an ideal choice for directional signs that guide drivers on their way without causing stress or confusion. The psychology of color plays a crucial role in traffic sign design. Our brains process colors differently, and each color can evoke specific emotional responses. Green is universally associated with progress, safety, and tranquility. It's a color that suggests go, which aligns perfectly with its use in directional and informational signs. White, on the other hand, is associated with clarity, simplicity, and cleanliness. It provides a stark contrast against the green, ensuring that the text or symbols on the sign are easily readable, even from a distance. Visibility is another critical factor. Traffic signs need to be visible in various lighting conditions, including bright sunlight, dusk, and at night. The combination of white text on a green background offers excellent visibility and readability. The high contrast between these two colors makes the sign stand out, ensuring that drivers can quickly and easily read the information they need while on the move. This is especially important on highways and busy roads where drivers may only have a few seconds to glance at a sign. Weather conditions can also affect the visibility of traffic signs. Rain, fog, and snow can obscure signs, making it essential that they are designed to be as visible as possible in all conditions. The green and white combination is highly effective in maintaining visibility, even in adverse weather. The reflective materials used in modern traffic signs further enhance their visibility, ensuring that the signs can be seen even in low-light conditions. The production of traffic signs is a sophisticated process that incorporates materials designed to withstand various environmental factors. High-grade reflective sheeting, durable inks, and robust substrates ensure that the signs remain legible and visible for many years. The green color used in these signs is specifically chosen for its resistance to fading, even when exposed to harsh sunlight and weather conditions. 
At night, the reflectivity of traffic signs becomes crucial. The retro-reflective materials used in green and white traffic signs reflect light from vehicle headlights back towards the driver, making the signs appear brightly lit and easy to read. This technology significantly enhances nighttime visibility, reducing the risk of accidents caused by missed or misread signs. While green and white are standard in many countries, it's interesting to note that different regions have their own color conventions based on local standards and cultural perceptions. For example, in some European countries, blue and white are commonly used for informational signs. Despite these variations, the principles of visibility, readability, and psychological impact remain consistent. The choice of colors for traffic signs is a result of extensive research and testing. Green and white have proven to be highly effective in providing clear, concise information to drivers. The goal is to create a road environment where drivers can navigate safely and efficiently, and color plays a significant role in achieving this. Another important aspect of traffic sign color selection is uniformity. When drivers encounter consistent color schemes, they can more easily understand and react to the signs. This uniformity helps in building a predictable and reliable road environment, reducing the cognitive load on drivers and allowing them to focus on the road ahead. The installation of traffic signs follows strict guidelines to ensure they are placed in optimal locations for maximum visibility and effectiveness. Engineers consider factors such as sight lines, traffic speed, and road layout when determining where to place signs. This careful planning ensures that the signs can perform their intended function effectively. Green and white signs come in various shapes and sizes, each serving a specific purpose. From highway exit signs to street name markers and directional arrows, the consistent use of these colors helps drivers quickly identify the type of information being conveyed. This rapid recognition is crucial in high-speed driving environments where quick decision-making is essential. Over the decades, traffic signs have evolved to incorporate new materials and technologies, but the core principles of color use have remained constant. The adoption of green and white for informational and directional signs has proven to be a successful strategy in creating a safe and efficient driving environment. In complex driving environments, such as highway interchanges and urban intersections, the clarity and visibility of traffic signs are even more critical. Green and white signs provide the necessary guidance to help drivers make quick, accurate decisions, reducing the risk of accidents and improving traffic flow. To sum up, the choice of green and white for traffic signs is a result of careful consideration of visibility, psychology, and practicality. These colors have been chosen to provide clear, concise information to drivers, ensuring that our roads are safe and easy to navigate. So the next time you see a green and white traffic sign, you'll know there's a lot more behind those colors than meets the eye. Thanks for watching. Safe travels. Thank you for joining us on this journey through the history of simple things. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and stay tuned for more stories woven through the smallest details.